بیشتر مگه لایپ خوشه چون کو سرکفتن و سرفرازی یا کردستان درخی نیتن True art to me speaks to a part of your human soul. Well, it was a new experience for me. I've never done a project like this, and I can't just speak for everybody else in the group. We've never did a project like this as far as art. I think that it's a wonderful opportunity to have exposure uh, and having uh, people who normally maybe you know don't get that type of exposure to different cultures. I think that sometimes art has a bad rap in terms of being a, a bit elitist. We really got to connect with our culture as far as the story goes and how the story makes up our, our culture. We had the story of Kawa the blacksmith. It's symbolic because it tells the story of basically every Kurdish person. They struggle, They're, they feel like they've been oppressed, they feel like they have to fight back and it has a lot of aspects that relate to real life in Kurdistan. The story, uh, it was a king named Zohak and uh, he was cursed with the uh, two snakes and uh, he had control over most or all of Kurdistan and the Middle East and uh, what, what it was, he had to be fed and the brains of a child and through time, too many kids were dying, and uh, Kawa, the blacksmith, uh, had seven sons, and his last son was to be killed by the king, and he decided to stand up to him and got a group of people together and uh, went up against the king and went and killed the king, and while doing this, he had uh, the group gathered and told him that when I lit light the fire, it's that's the signal, as in, victory and the fire therefore symbolizes uh, freedom peace new beginning and our new year's is in march 21st and every year during our new year we light a fire which symbolizes freedom new beginning so yeah i feel very proud um not just for myself but like for for the whole kurdish community you know because we've never had anything this big um, for people to see and at the end I think I could speak for everyone when we couldn't wait to put the whole piece together just because of all the hard work and all the Saturdays we had to meet up and everything it is pretty big it's an uh, amazing way to represent our Kurdish culture and then the Kurds most of the Kurds here in Tennessee if you are open to see it you can see art in everything